We are not done with the weather threats just yet. We have a coastal flood advisory in effect through midnight tonight for our, all of our coastal counties here along the Atlantic Ocean waters. Cumberland County is not in the advisory, so move your cars if you need to again this evening, especially after the coastal flooding we had this morning. For those away from the coast, we have a freeze warning in effect. That's from 2 to 9 a.m. Everywhere on the mainland, save for Rio Grande on south here in mainland Cape May County. Rainfall totals over the past two days were quite high. We were over two and a half for most places. Some places over three and a half. Beach Haven, Atlantic City, and Foresight over in Galloway, all over three and a half inches of rain. Thankfully, our ground could handle it, but it did help to exaggerate some of the coastal flooding issues both last night as well as this morning. We're going to see a round of minor flood stage as we go into this evening. A few rows will flood. This will be just the usual spot. So Black Horse Pike between Atlantic City and Pleasantville. White Horse Pike as well. Some of those jug hands there and Shore Road and Absecon. We'll also have water on it. it. Could even be closed for about an hour or two. But this is a nuisance flooding that we see about two dozen times a year. For tonight, most of the mainland's below freezing. Fortescue's at 34. West Cape May's at 36. Again, when you get south of about the canal, I think our low temperatures even on the mainland will be above freezing. And then everywhere at the shore will be above freezing. Make sure to take in any sensitive plants if you are inland. We're going to start off quite cold, winter jacket worthy, and then as we go into our Halloween, maybe not Hawaiian tourist costume day, but it's maybe a day for a Viking costume, something warm, Santa suit, that could work as well. Temperatures will slide through to 40s as we go into our evening. Now we have our second full moon of the month, our blue moon in the eastern horizon for our Halloween. Next time we're going to have a blue moon on Halloween, 2039, so soak it in today. Mars, Saturn, and Jupiter will all be visible at somewhere between the eastern and southern sky. Then before you go to bed on Halloween, turn your clocks back. Standard time resumes at 2 a.m. And that means our sunsets will be before 5 p.m. Now our sun rises will also be before 7 a.m. again. So you get that early light. It is actually dry for the morning, but rain does start during the afternoon. It's going to be kind of two rounds of rain here. The bigger shot comes during the afternoon hours. Then we dry out, but then another round of showers will come for the evening hours. And look what's behind that. We'll let it loop one more time. Blues, that is snow and actually lake effect snow in western Pennsylvania. No lake effect snow for us, but we are talking about high temperatures in the upper 40s, and that's about 12 degrees below average for this time of year. It's a windy day as well wind chills will be in the low 40s then we'll kind of improve a little bit each day and by the time we get towards the later part of the week t-shirt weather here in south jersey and plenty of sunshine so after a rough week with multiple storm systems and not a lot of sun quite the opposite as we go into our first week of november have a great weekend everybody we'll be back with you monday morning with the latest in south jersey weather you can follow me on social media for the latest we'll have you covered all weekend long you can always come back to our website for articles radar and more pressofac.com slash weather